All right, switching gears tonight, it is now a buyer's market when it comes to real estate in Niagara Falls. At least for today, with a special auction of foreclosed properties. More than 320 parcels were up for grabs. It all centers around a push to improve life in the Cataract City. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Josh Bazan is on the story tonight. My heart still races every time I go. There's a lot of uh, excitement to buying houses. Um, but you also, you do need to be careful. <laughs> Danielle Pruitt and her family run Buffalo Turnkey Properties, a property management company in western New York. They spent Tuesday in Niagara Falls bidding on property seized by the city through tax foreclosure. Honey, 600. Sold it in the back, $2,500. Don't get caught in the excitement and bid over because it's... It can happen. Hundreds of homes, buildings, and vacant lots were up for auction. At least one empty lot sold for only $100. But the deep discounts might not always be a good deal. Bidders haven't been allowed inside any of the homes to check for issues and have to purchase property based on what they can see from the outside. So that's that's a, definitely a risk that you have to be willing to take in order to buy properties. You can lose money and you can lose a lot of it if you don't know what you're doing. Pruitt has found homes with foundation issues or stolen hot water heaters, but that risk is oftentimes worth it when they can clean up a home for a family looking for a nice place to live. One of our big reasons is that we live in Buffalo. We live in this area and we want to better our community. These houses are they're broken down, they're dilapidated, and so we buy them and we fix them up and then we rent them. In Niagara Falls, Josh Bazan, 7 Eyewitness News.